since I'm the guy who started this whole crazy thing, I figured I should be the first one to answer this question and get the ball rolling. Um, the answer is actually really easy for me because I was a child of the 80s and I grew up without any real positive male role models. And watching Star Trek was the way that I learned the right way to do things. It was their, their morality and their respect for each other and respect for everything, even things that were different than they were. Those were lessons that I would not have learned if it hadn't have been for Star Trek. And the reason why we're trying so hard to get this show made is that Michael's intention is to return to that type of storytelling. Um, and I kind of feel like, pardon the pun, but the next generation needs a Star Trek. You know, my kids need a Star Trek. There should be some place where they can go to watch people who have evolved beyond our petty differences of today, people who make the right choice, even when it's the hard choice to make. Um, and I'd also like to see that we survive. You know, call me crazy. I, I, I love zombies. They're very cool. Um, and everyone loves a good post-apocalyptic storyline, but I'm kind of crazy in that I think we're going to make it. I tend to believe Gene Roddenberry's original vision, and I think we are going to grow out of our infancy, and I think we are going to make it, and I think we're going to become an amazing society. And I'd like to see that idea reflected somewhere in our pop culture entertainment thing that we have going on in our country. Everything is so negative and hopeless, and I'm not. And I don't think a lot of you are. I think a lot of you are very hopeful, too. So. I just want to see a show that reflects that. I want to see something that goes back to the good old days of the original Star Trek and TNG and DS9 and Voyager, Enterprise, all of that. You know, they had those great little morality plays every week, and I think we need that. So that's why I'm doing this. That's my story. What's yours?